I predict the Dallas Cowboys defense leads them to an upset win over the New York Giants at MetLife Stadium. Now the Giants have only given up seven sacks all season. They only have six giveaways offensively, but that Dallas front is a lot more potent now with Greg Hardy in the mix. I don't think that Matt Castle, the Cowboys' new quarterback, does anything special, but I don't think he kills them either. They're coming off a bye, Giants on a short week, Cowboys end their three-game skid. I predict the Panthers' defense holds the Philadelphia Eagles to under 50 yards rushing, and Carolina stays unbeaten. Now, Philadelphia's offense has been on the climb over the past couple of weeks, the turnovers notwithstanding, but that Carolina defense, so tough when Luke Keekley is on the field. I think Keekley has a huge day, Panthers win. I predict it's the Dion Lewis show as the New England Patriots beat the New York Jets. LeGarrette Blunt carried the load for the Patriots last week at Indianapolis, but I don't see Bill Belichick trying to win with power football against that stout Jets front. Lewis can make those linebackers from the Jets run a little bit, exploit some matchups. Tom Brady always can control the middle of the field. I think both those guys have big days. I predict two of this week's stars are young quarterbacks, and neither one is Marcus Mariota. Jameis Winston and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers go to Washington. Derek Carr and the Oakland Raiders are at San Diego. Both those teams have tough pass defenses, but both these quarterbacks and their offenses had an extra week to prepare. Good opportunity to get a road win under their belts and get their teams back to 500.